Hey guys, it's Paul. I want to give you like a, an introduction to thinking about social media, thinking about different platforms and how you can use them to get leads, to try and find if there's any work to be had, any sales to be done outbound into social media, even when you don't know anything about the, the people or uh, who you may be dealing with. So let me just do a scatty introduction to it. It's awkward this because it's a bit weird to show you. But hopefully I can show you something that makes a little bit of sense of, of, of not knowing anything about a customer, but reaching out and trying to get a conversation going that may end up in a sale. So on my website, it's all free training, but I also have these YouTube, Instagram influencer links of rankings of who's the highest, um, who's the most followed footballer in this, cha in this case, football team. <clears throat> so what I'm thinking is here, is I'm going to go to League 2 and filter it to League 2. And I'm going to, I'm in Doncaster. So I'm going to come here and see, look, Doncaster Rovers are number 12. Now, what I want is where Doncaster Rovers on their Twitter here. It's going to say doncasterrovers.com. But I imagine I want them to change that to pnuk.com forward slash drfc or something like that, or whatever it is. It's probably DR, Doncaster Rovers official. So I'm going to tease something out of Doncaster Rovers if I can. And they're 12th, right? So I'm going to grab this and I'm going to put uh, just a silly, just a silly idea to give you just thoughts on how to, how to maybe uh, start a conversation with bigger companies than you. So I'm going to grab that picture and I'm going to grab... I don't like the, the URL at the top. I'm just going to grab the football. And I'm going to go here and put... Now, this might not be the best example because they're not, they might not be across all, all platforms. But anyway, sorry, I've clicked new post. And now you'll see at the top, I can send this to my Facebook, my Twitter, my LinkedIn company, my Instagram, my Pinterest, my LinkedIn profile, my Google business, my Facebook group, my YouTube, or my TikTok. Now, it's just an image... So I'm not going to be able to send it to things like TikTok and uh, YouTube. But I'm not logged into any of them other than I've just shown you that I am. But I can click here now and attach this. Now it's going to tell me all the ones we've read at the top. I can't send it to um, Pinterest, TikTok, YouTube. But the rest I'm good for. So I'm going to put um, can uh, I put at as I type in Doncaster. Rovers, it's going to search Facebook for them. There it is. There it is on Facebook. We've tagged them. On Twitter, Doncaster Rovers. We're going to put Doncaster Rovers. There we are. Official. On LinkedIn. I always used to call it LinkedIn. Doncaster Rovers, right? So I've now tagged them on all those um, platforms. Now, you can tag on Instagram. You can go here and do, I think it'll be DRFC official now the only thing you would have to work out if that is them and sometimes it's easier to tag them direct but let's just pretend that that's them because it's not really going to do anything can the rfc get to the top of league to youtube rankings paste in the um url add a youtube uh football Maybe a PNUK, someone's making noise, they might come in. And I'm going to send that out, right? Post it out. And that's going to send it all the way across to all these different platforms. And now, there we go. You can see at the bottom, it's gone, it's gone to Facebook. Again, I'm not logged in. It's gone to, to the Facebook group. It's gone to Twitter. It's gone to LinkedIn. And Donny Roberts. Oh, this is the this that was the other one. They're all going to go through eventually, right? Now, in the hope Doncaster Rovers reply, I'll show you what would happen, and then we'll show you two other ways of reaching out to Doncaster Rovers anyway. But if I log in, this is a separate account on a different browser. This is nothing to do with that main account, right? So if I go refresh this, Team Punk's only really following. Uh, PNUK, but Twitter's or X is a little bit weird, isn't it? So anyway, it's this. 
It's this tweet, right? Can DRFC, Don Kessarovas tagged. No, I wasn't in there. And they, you wrote, if we imagine that this is, I'm going to put, um, let's hope they climb the table in footy. And YouTube, right? So imagine that's Don Rovers. They're actually replying. It isn't. It's me on a separate account. I just want to show you what happens when people do reply. <clears throat> in in five to ten seconds, you're going to get a lot, one new entry here. One new. If I click on it, it's going to show Team Punk is a lead because I've already done this video about four times. Um, and I can go in and see everything they're saying. I can reply to them. I I don't know why. Uh, here we go. You have to click reply here. Sometimes like then you can actually send this out. Now I don't know if this is going to work. Seems to. It doesn't. It, I have set it up. Oh, there we go. It's working now. It's why. It's what killed the last video. <laughs> I set it up and it stopped. It didn't work. So what I like is. Um, imagine I'm going to try and get them to that link, and they've just they've replied, and. They might say, it might have been more like something more along the lines of, uh, hey, where's Team Punk on this list, right? So you might actually catch a completely different team or a different company out of it, right? So when this comes through, what I want to do is send a private message and say, Send us a message and we will we'll get you sorted, right? So we're going to go here. We're going to go here again and click this little button. Uh, oh, no. Where is the... Um, all replies. Hey, where's... Here we go. Go away. Oh, let's just click this. Right? It'll go if you click. Get rid of that, right? Uh, ah, sorry, we missed you. Uh, send us a DM and we'll get you sorted. So this is good for uh, any kind of customer service, isn't it? Add to DM and it'll send a private message. Tweet. It's gone to there. This is going to get a notification. And look, it's this cool look. Oh, sorry, we missed you. Send us a DM. And this is clicking this link. will set up a private DM. Uh, hey, it's... Team Punk, uh, what do I need to do? Right, so imagine that that was Doncaster Rovers, though. <laughs> Again, we're going to get a notification. We're going to be able to see it. I, I, because I've already set them up, I'm sort of going to leave leave that to, to being that. Because what I want to show you is how to leverage the company that you're not contacted or you've got no reply from. So this is DRSC, right? We're going to go to Doncaster Rovers and we're going to say, I want this link or I want some social link. I want them to become a member. Even if they don't link to us, it's £3 a month. I want them to become a member. So I'm going to click here, add to CRM. And it's going to say, last name, Doncaster Rovers. We don't know the company. We don't know the person we're dealing with. We don't know the company. It might be a different company, but it probably is Doncaster Rovers. First name, we don't know. We don't know the email. We don't know a phone number, but if this is going to a salesperson, it's not, it's me. I might just add a description. Uh, I think they will be interested in punk membership uh, and a login link, a profile link, right? So in this case, I'm probably not going to get the link, am I? I'm not going to get because it's a big company it's it's they've got a website they don't need a social media link tree link because they'll just point people to their website <clears throat> but i might be able to get them to use that profile i might be able to get them to go oh we like it if you can make it pnuk.com drfc we, that's easier to say than go to doncasterrovers.com or whatever it might be so there might be a deal to be had in a smaller uh, instance there right Am I, did I follow them? Uh, I clicked on connections. Most engaged followers, Twitter followers, CRM leads. Here we go. So now 
now we are we can see what we've added to the system. I added Jack Grealish last night playing around. But when I click on Doncaster Rovers now, I can see the CRM information and I can go to the CRM. So we've not logged in. As the person operating this and anybody else in your team, they can see we've added Doncaster Rovers. Now we might go to the to the profile. We might see down the bottom here. Whoever else might now take it on in the lead. It's their job to go find... Oh, I just unfollowed them. There's the message coming through from them. Oh, there's a phone number, look. Right? So it might be, it might be whoever's job it is to find out that the... the uh, I don't even know who the Donny Rovers manager is. The... Oh, let's go up here. Edit. We've gone and we've found a phone number. Google, this is all public information. Or YouTube, this is just sample stuff. Don't do me for sharing information. We might say that the, the person's last name is Smith. First name, John. Um, title is social media manager. Uh, anything else to fill out there? That's just sort of the contact. And we might have had a contact to say, can we now contact you about this? Yes, we can. We might have had a message, uh, for, you know, like this message. Oh, sorry. Ciara, where's the message gone? Twitter. Uh, oh, messages up here. I don't use it enough, right? I'm, I'm kind of getting into this myself, and it's a reason I've set up PNUK as it is, because I'll get more interaction with people on that. So here's the message. Uh, um, can we... Uh, contact you direct about this. All right, bang. They'll come through. Yeah, my email is, I don't know, John Smith at, right, whatever it is. Bang. So I've now, we've, they're interested. This is pretending to be Doncaster Rovers. They're interested. They want to talk to us, right? So now we know that this email is John Smith uh, at pnuk.com. Don't email that, it'll just come to me. And we're ready to go. We're ready to now to convert this from a lead. We've we've taken it, we've touched base with them. They're happy to deal with us. They kind of know what they're getting. And we're going to go across and we're going to convert the lead that can just be grapevine information. Just just you know, you know, we've quantified the lead. We've turned him into a contact. We're turning Doncaster Rovers into the account, and the contact for us is John Smith. And we're going to create a deal. Now, the deal, depending again, if you're in a smaller business, if you were like, if this were me doing this, I'd go, how much is this value to my business to get Doncaster Rovers to change that profile here, change this link? What the hell? Um, change this link so that it says pnuk.com forward slash drfc. That value to my business would be a thousand pounds, ten thousand pounds. More and more people clicking on it, maybe a bigger team. But in essence, the membership is three pound a month. So I'm just going to put a year's. If they're a member for a year, this deal is going to be worth thirty six quid, right? I'm going to give myself two weeks to close the deal, uh, and I'm going to go. Link research or contact customer. So we're maybe a little bit further on the funnel than just getting ready. Leave it in pounds. Now, what the, what would be cool with this campaign source would be if for some reason I promoted, I promoted that tweet. I don't know if I've got, I haven't got promotions set up. But on here, it would say promote. If I had my business account set up, it would say promote. And if I put hundred pound on that on that tweet. What I might do is set up a campaign that is uh, the Twitter football source or ad, the Twitter football ad. Now, every time I got someone to sign up, I would tag that that was coming from the advert and all these, all the money when the deals are won would add up on that advert and make, out, make, um, make it show that it's worth doing or not. I haven't got it set up. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to change the contact role to decision maker and convert right so now again we're not been in twitter we haven't been in anything we've sent it out everywhere my whatsapp's turned on 
<laughs> so we're going to start getting messages. Let me turn it off. I forgot it's Wednesday. So now we have an account, a contact, and a deal. And we go to deals. And uh, we're going to see here, Doncaster Rovers, 36 quid deal. We go into the, the deal. Does the Twitter show up on? Yeah, the Twitter. Oh, no, that's the... Uh, I was playing around with that's the LinkedIn Twitter. Uh, I don't know if the Twitter does show up in the um, in the deal. Is it just the contact? If we go to John Smith. Uh, mm -mm. Doncaster. Yeah, there's there's in the information's in here. So sometimes you might want to go see the, see their information, look at what they've said before you contact them. You might have seen they've lost or won at the weekend. Anything like that. But what we're trying to do is get this deal from this contact customer all the way across, if you know your CRM, to closed one. So what I might do is say, uh, we might go back and say, uh, check out your link. Your link, which is, it was like a long link, wasn't it? Long link. Check out your link. So I want to show you something else that will happen here. Uh, check out your link. Uh, the, um, and tell me if it is all correct. To Mondo, don't put that. That might be, maybe be a bit nicer than me. Check out your link, right? So this, when we go to the CRM, there's three people on the website. Uh, now, Philippines, India, United Kingdom. So this person's on Doncaster Rovers FC, which is me. So let me close these off. Because what I want you to see is another idea. Again, just that next level. So look, he's got this picture. Oh, PNUK, Doncaster Rovers, YouTube channel, social. And when we go to the link, we're going to see... Uh, da -da. We're going to see... Eventually, that person come in if it's if it's working properly, and then you can go. Oh, I've just sent them a link, and they're on the website. It was a bit annoying that I've been on that website. Here we go, four now, right? So Doncaster over seven pages. Uh, visit a visit Philippines, United Kingdom, ten pages, six fifty. It's this one, right? So this one, see this here. So we can go here. I can go and jump to Zoho Sales IQ. It's telling me to do it on a map. And 19 sec this one, 39 seconds. Uh, West Park in Dorset. That's not it's, it ain't me. <laughs> Just make sure it's not me. Right. I can go, uh, hello. Can I help? Am I pretty sure this has to be? Yeah. I'm going to put this. How does it look? Donny. <laughs> be a lot nicer to me. Now, when I go here, that person who's, who's looking at that, that, that um, product on your website, I'm, look, oh my God, this guy's, uh, yeah, it looks great. Right, and here we go. Yeah, it looks great. And now I'm live chatting on my website with them. What I don't particularly like is, let me show you here, look. If I start tapping, if I go like this, um, all right, we're going to be nicer, but let's cut to the chase. It's three pound a month. Is it any good to you? I, I'm definitely not a salesman, am I? Right. And then when they type, I'm pretty sure. Uh, yeah, that I might have turned it off. Look, see how they haven't. See how they haven't sent, and I can see. Oh, he's put, yeah, that's good. Oh, oh, oh he's deleted it. No. Uh, we'd pay one pound. Right, but I can see here. Now, I usually say, look, I'll just let you know. I can see you type him. Um, a month. I don't know why it didn't say a pound there. I don't know why one's blurred out. <laughs> and then he might delete it again. But then you go, look. Uh, then you might go, you can see he's messing about it. Say, hey, how about uh, one month for free to see how it goes? 
then we revisit in a month. Yeah. I don't know what I'm saying yet yeah to, right? So here it comes. Yeah, uh, that sounds good. Uh, can you track visitors? And click. I can't, but I'm going to put yeah. <laughs> So don't ask me if you want your own profile. Don't ask. I can, but it's it's a lot of hassle. But I, yeah, I probably can work out how to do that better. Um, can you visit? Um, can you do visitors and clicks? Um, yeah, that sounds good. Yeah, no problem. Uh, let me know what else you need. And send. Done. Person's gonna leave, and now we we are further down the pipeline, which we may be on our pipeline. Need to set up a, um, you know, a waiting for sign off, or maybe maybe we put an extra pipeline in. So we go to settings, we go modules, we go to deals, we go uh, da -da -da -da, map modules. Uh, edit layouts. Start, no deals. I'm in deals. Edit. Uh, oh man, I was here earlier. Where was I? Um, I literally have just done all this deals. Here we go. Uh, map dependency. No, no, no. Oh man, it's in deals. New layout. Uh, module position stage probability. Oh, here we go. This is. Brain just stops working when I start doing these. View add. Uh, I'm in here. We're going to go. So after sign off, before sign off, I'm going to add a uh, free trial. Something like this, right? And if we give them a free trial, I think I'm 85% Omen host. Select category, open pipeline, pipeline, save. So now when we go back to deals, we have got the free trials, so we've got um, oh, the free trials after sign off, which is right. So we're now we're in free trial mode. Eventually, the month's out. We send an email, ask them to sign off. Maybe send a contract if a contract's up, uh, anything in there. So here was a contact. You're all sorted. The information's coming through. If they jump back on and we see they're still live, we will be able to... I'm not sure if the um, the lead's been tracked at that point. Stage, contacts, roles, John Smith. I, I don't... It might not know if that was that. I'm not sure if I set that up properly, that, that, um, that discussion. Products. Uh, and, yeah. <laughs> I, I, I play around with this... It's going to be more active in the future, but I can't see the, the live chat. Maybe I'm, I'm looking in the wrong place. But anyway, I'm going to go back. Uh, which one was it? We reckon it was today, six and a half minutes. This one, we're going to go back. So it's already open at the top. Do, 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 visitor. Uh, session recording, at least. No, it's not this one. It's probably easier to go up here and it's in my charts, yeah. See, I don't know, I, I don't do enough of this stuff and this will get me into it more. Uh, hey, John, a month is up on uh, Friday. Uh, what do you need? What do you need to join? Back to John. Uh, just the sign up link. Thanks. Right, bang, okay, uh, pnuk.com, join, I don't know if it even is that. Uh, oh yeah, didn't like the link, does it, HTTPS, join, you don't have to do anything fancy with a link, do you, do you, add a link, no, uh, yeah, that worked, bang, Bang, 
And then wherever your sales sign-off page, it actually is pnuk.com, join. And if, it depends on what they choose. If you want to become a, a Patreon, they can join the Patreon for three quid. They sign up. Jobs are good. Um, back to the CRM. Recent chats. Uh, is the chat in the... It used to say CRM, didn't it? Recent chats. Yeah, maybe I haven't tagged them properly as that customer. Back here. Anyway, back to the deal. Multiple ways to close the deal, but the easiest way is just to drag. Job done. £36. If they've paid a bit more, if you've got some add-ons, if you've got something more to add, if they've paid a bit less, save away. That job's done. Whatever the process is after the job is closed, goes to another customer and you're on to the next one. Your sales team, your social media team have generated some revenue that's that's made it worthwhile for them to, uh, uh, to do more social media, to see that there's more gains. I don't know if I'm logged in here. So on this second page, I want you to show you, yeah, I'm logged in. So this is now as a different person. So this is a guy called Max on my team that can jump in and answer questions and oh, if it actually clicked open. Now, it doesn't need to be me. So it's a bit confusing, but this is me. And this on the other browser is Max. And again, all replies. Team Pong. Uh, again, let me get rid of this. Great to have you on board. Uh, thanks, right? And this, so this is another person taking over, could take over the sale. It isn't, I've got to do everything. It, maybe I just want to hire someone to deal with my social media. That isn't me. This isn't me. This is me. Lo logged into Instagram, not logged into all these other places. But I've generated a place where I've talked to a customer without ever logging into anything other than Zoho Social via Zoho One, uh, the CRM. We obviously, now we could go through to project management. We can go through to invoicing. We can have it all done in one place. And hopefully that's been an eye-opening for you. It's all part of the Zoho One subscription, which I thoroughly recommend. If you've got any questions, I know it was scatty, but hopefully it's given you some ideas that... Um, it's not maybe as hard to post to every single social and do business within messaging and tracking people without having to spend your life in the river of poo, basically, that are social media feeds. Anyway, come to pnuk.com. If you've got a business or a YouTube channel and you want to be on one of these listings and you want to be a member, £3 a month, uh, dive in, ask questions. I'm here to help. Hopefully it can make you um, more sales yourself, more leads. If you're a business or a company, get your own paid job. You know, that what we'd love to see is pnuk.com forward slash what your feed is. If, if before you become a website owner yourself and you're driving them all here, put them on, put them on a PNUK page uh, and let's share your links. Let's get you more customers. Let's keep you building and growing your businesses. But let's do it so it's not a complete grind. Anyway, I have waffled right on. Cheers for watching. See you all again soon. Punk out.